indignation. Do you read me, Jenny? Yes. Loud and clear, Bucky. Any sign of trouble? Negative. No enemy patrol spotted yet. But there's got to be more toads around there somewhere. Ah, uh, Bucky, me boy. I wish you'd let old dead eye come with you. My, they're itching to fry the what's up a few dozen fly munching toadies. Sorry, dead eye. This is one mission I have to do alone. That flea bag of a fur bag? bag of a fur bag. You've gone and made me mad. Contact Bucky. Blinky, take over the controls. I've got to reach Willie. Willie! Willie, do you hear me? Yeah? Who's there? Willie, use the memory stone. Jenny! Wow! I can hear you in my head. Willie, we're under attack. And we've lost communications. Please come quickly. We need you. Uh, sure, y you bet. I'm on my way. Hey! Good to see you again, Willie. <laughs> yeah, here's your battle suit. Okay, thanks, Bruiser. And, and they need you up there! Jenny, what's going on? Where's Bucky? He's on Warren. He's consulting with his mentor. His mentor? Some mysterious teacher who taught him how to be a warrior. That's all Bucky would tell us. We've got to contact him. See if you can get that communications console working. Right, you got it. I'll never rest till I find where our captured people are and free them from toad slavery. That's why I've come to seek the mentor's wisdom. Bucky O'Hare. Remember, it is easier to take a fortress from the inside by stealth than from outside by force. Bucky O'Hare! Righteous indignation. Come in, Bucky. It's working, but I still can't raise him. That means one thing. Something has happened to him. Full power, Blinky. We're going back to Warren. Get your slime nips off me. I'll slay 
marketing for the likes of you wart bags. Ooh, does the big bad captain think he's too good to join the slave pen with his brothers? Well, we'll see. Get me the air marshal. hardly move while they watch Toad TV. Not for much longer. Bucky O'Hare will save us. Ah, oh, not this Bucky O'Hare character again. That's all you hares talk about. Look, he's the greatest hair warrior of all time. And he will come. You'll see. Yeah, sure. You'll excuse me if I don't hold my breath. You there! Shut up! There's another thing. Any slave caught in the act of sabotage will be... Severely punished! Air Marshal, an urgent call from Captain Smarta. What? Smarta? Greetings, Air Marshal. I have incredible news. Look at this. Bucky O'Hare is our prisoner. Bucky O'Hare at last? Oh, how you will suffer at my hands. I'll, I'll find the deepest, darkest pit and throw you in it. Thanks. I need a vacation. Captain Shimada, send him to me here on Kinyar at watch. Kinyar, eh? In the Minotaur sector. Yes. You're home till your fur falls out, Mammo. Get him out of my sight. I take great pleasure in announcing a new slave on his way. Bucky O'Hare! How could it happen? How? He was our last hope. So much for your great warrior. Look, it's what I've said to you all along. We can't depend on anybody but ourselves. Listen, this is the perfect chance for me to sneak a look at their computers and figure out what this project really is. Cover me. and I obey. Blinky, I've intercepted a scrambled toast transmission to that warship. Unscramble and play it back. Put Bucky O'Hare in your fastest transport and send him back here. Attention, all hands! The toads have captured Bucky! 
We're going after them. Willie, I need full power from the engine. You've got it, Jenny. to get some information. And now I think I understand what my mentor meant when he said it's easier to take a fortress from the inside by stealth than from the outside by force. But how can we get inside fortress? We can't. But old Angus McChump can. Who? network gang over there. O'Hare were here. He... Oh, Bucky O'Hare! Bucky O'Hare! If I hear the name Bucky O'Hare one more time, I'll scream! If you don't want me to lead you, say so. Shh. Not a word. I'll handle this. Well, my vote goes for the little lady. Yes, sir. Angus McJunk will follow you anywhere. Uh, thank you, Angus. 
Are the rest of you with me? You you with you, 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 you. We're with you, Mimi. Ah, fight. Ah, show those toads a thing or two. That's, that's good of you, sir, but I'm afraid we need the stronger, younger folks. Huh. I'll have you know I'm not a day over 93. All right. You can be a lookout. I hope you can see. Our entire plan depends on reaching the command platform at the top of the dome. I need the best jumper you got. Larry was the best jumper on Warren, except for Bucky... Uh, you know who. Here's what we have to do. Gather round. I'm not too good at taking orders. If it isn't my old friend, the air marshal, pardon me for dropping in unannounced. I've got a factory to shut down. You, you dirty rat! Tear! Tears of Warren. I've come to set you free. We ain't got no use. Our guns have been deactivated. It's Bucky! Bucky O'Hare! And he's magnificent. Our long-range sensors show the factory's defenses have gone down. Bucky's done it. Hang on, we're going in. Bucky O'Hare, you are the greatest. Yeah, nice work, old-timer. I like your style. Just one thing. Don't call me Foxy. Now, this is fun. Wow. This looks just like the one we destroyed on Genus. I wonder if... Now, hear this, you despicable furballs. You haven't escaped me yet. Unless you surrender and return to your slave pit, I will blow up this entire factory. But, but Air Marshal, sir, there are toads in there, too. Rats is in there. A small sacrifice, but why worry? The mammals have no choice but to surrender. I hope he must have the whole factory lined with explosives. We'll never get out of here. Oh, he's beaten us. Not that easy. Willie, step up a little surprise for our toad friends. No problem, Bucky. I repeat, move into the slave pit at once. I am losing my patience. Okay, hit the power.
Willie, you're a genius. No problem. You know, I bet if your scientists work on this, it could reverse what it did to your planet. The United Animal Security Council names you captain of this new frigate. Congratulations, Captain Luffloo. Uh, I can't thank you enough. Thank Bucky O'Hare. It was his idea. I will. In my own way. <laughs> Some people have no sense of propriety. Me, humble android, has the name of new starship? The screaming moon.
koala. Yeah. You know, I just lost 5,000 simoleons, you want back. Awfully quiet out here, did I? If the toads have taken over Rigel 5, why aren't there any toad patrols? <laughs> Never trust the silence me. your photon accelerator. Ours is already turned on. Jenny! Willie, link up with us right away, please. We need your help to save the koalas. Koalas? Hi, guys. What's up? Not up, Willie. Down. We can't reach the surface of Rigel 5. <laughs> it's them toes. They put up some kind of electronic roadblock. Well, after carefully reviewing the data on the Rigel 5 defense shield, yeah, yeah. I couldn't find a clue. Double bubble approaching Rigel 5. Hey, how come? How come them toads got through? Their ship's made out of metal just like ours. I've got it. The difference is they're cold-blooded and we're not. The defense mechanism is programmed to keep out mammals. That means we can't get through to rescue the koalas. You're right. We can't. But Blinky can. Toast supply ship. Three o'clock. Good luck, big guy. Bingo! Found the supply hat. Don't do nothing I wouldn't do, Blinky. down that defense shield, it's Blinky. Welcome to Michael 5, Android First Class. Mm. Oh, sorry. Ah, can this be the famous Blinky we've heard so much about? Mm. Could be. <laughs> Where I come from, spies don't live long enough to tell why they're spies. I say we soak the little screw head in water and let him rot. Fortunately, I possess a superior solution. I tell you, I like Miss Willy Pad. Look at those boys. 
Not as gorgeous as Miss Crocodile. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, the crowning of this year's Miss Toad TV. Ready, girls? Drum roll, please. Ah, oh, come on, come on, get on with it. The winner of this year's contest and the new Miss Toad TV is... Come on! <laughs> Who won? I don't know, but if we don't catch that android, we lose. Sound the alarm! No one escapes Toad Air Marshal. Rolling cockroach. <laughs> Toad Buffet, my favorite. Wait, let me deal. Take this. It's one of my favorites. You have been had. He's a hologram. Double bubbles coming fast. Get eye, man the major. We're under attack. <laughs> it's four to one. I like them on. Wait, don't shoot. The one being chased is Blinky. Hold your fire, Dead Eye. Jenny, open the launching platform. Platform open. but you showed those toads a thing or two. Actually, four or five. Glad to have you back, little buddy. <laughs> Blinky, did you deactivate the defense shield? Defense shield deactivated? <laughs> All right, then let's croak some toads! Look! Those mildewed mammals are coming back! I'll activate the defense shield! No! That will not be necessary. Gotta hand it to Blinky. Without that toad defense shield, it's smooth sailing. Humble robot must now do as programmed. No, cannot do that. Imperative. Negative. Must do as programmed. Must not. Must. What's happening? Directional stabilizer is malfunction. We're heading straight for the sun. Program that android to sabotage his own ship. Now, without Bucky or here to stop us, the universe will be ours. The computer.
is out of sync. <laughs> Something's happened to Blinky. I found him smacked off his gyroscope. The hyperdrive relays. That's why we're out of control. Why would Blinky sabotage us? This is a toad chip. Blinky's been reprogrammed. Willie, can you repair the hyperdrive relay before we hit the sun? Gotta fix Blinky first, if I can. Uh, yeah, well, you'd better hurry. It's getting awful hot in here. Toadborg, return to the mothership immediately. With Bucky O'Hare extinguished, plans for the final mammal invasion can be activated. Okay, Mr. Air Marshal, what about my 20,000 simoleons for the defense shield? Defense shield? Why do we need your defense shield? We've destroyed Bucky O'Hare. Look, old buddy, I want to be paid, and now. Sorry, Al, the technology's obsolete. I'm afraid you're out of touch with me. What was that? <laughs> a surprise. It's a killer bee bomb. And if I don't get paid now, you'll have a bee sting for every ward on your body. How, how could you? What, what, what are you doing here? AFC Blinky reporting for duty. Humble robot escape before tracking the sun. Ready for new assignment. <laughs> he's still reprogrammed. Thinks he's on your side. Yeah, I, I don't have time for you right now. Go relax for a while. If you took care of Bucky O'Hare, we'll take care of you. AFC Blinky, at your service. By simoleons, Air Marshal. Loud and clear, Blinky. Go ahead. Mammal defense shield inoperable. All clear to proceed with liberation of koalas. Well done, Blinky. <laughs> they fought it. Thanks to Willie helping Blinky, they fixed the hyperdrive in record time. And scuttling that fab fuel tank into the sun. <laughs> that gave us a genuine three of our fireball. Yeah! Let's go! go! My psychic intuition tells me those slimy toads are so busy having fun, they don't even know we're here. Uh, then let's stop John and croak those wet-footed water buckets. Not so fast, Dead Eye. There's only a handful of us and a fistful of them. We need a plan. Yeah, I have one. Anyone moves, you toad pudding! <clears throat> this is Bruiser, uh, uh, the Beetle Juicy and Berserker Babu. How much longer, Willie? Ten seconds, Bucky. <clears throat> Four, three, two, one. You're on the air, Bruiser. Uh, uh, uh this is B B Bruiser. Yeah, Bruiser. Bruiser, the Beetlejuicy and Berserker Baboon speaking. Now listen up, all you toes out there. It's the Berserker Baboon. <laughs> I'm unstoppable, unbeatable, and uncontrollable. <laughs> I like toads, especially toads what pay their debts. And I want every toad off of this planet now! <laughs> Who said that? Well, I pay each and every one of you bug-eyed, bald-headed banjos a visit poisonally! <laughs> He's not real! He's a hologram! Come on, Al! I need your help! For a friend? Sure. For another 600 simoleons? Why? Any toads I see are gonna get pulpated, crocated, and fast-potated! Oh.
It's those major mammals. That's impossible! Challenge! I didn't know holograms could shoot you! Some toes. 